Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be looking at a website that I recently discovered and found really cool. It's actually from Adobe, which everyone knows from Photoshop and Lightroom. But they have a new AI feature that I really wanted to try with you guys. So the feature itself is actually kind of targeted forwards like podcasts and long listening experiences where the audio quality really matters. But I know that pretty much everyone likes to watch videos that have good audio too. So I'm actually going to be using this feature for this whole video. And please let me know in the comments below how it turned out and how it actually sounds in the end. So let's get some audio files so you can actually hear some differences. And one of the quickest ways and probably the microphone that most of us have is well in our phone so i just opened audio recordings over on my iphone and i'm just gonna record a quick segment like for example this is an audio recording of the test footage that i want for the video so with our test sample ready we are going to jump on the website of podcast.adobe.com and here are the top panel you can see quick tools we are going to click on that and click on Enhance Speech, which is the feature that we want to try out today. As you can see, I forgot to log in, so I'm going to do that quickly. Okay, so sorry about that. I just logged in and of course, Adobe uses your Creative Cloud account. So in the meantime, I have also transported my file from my iPhone over to my PC. I just mailed it over or you can use AirDrop if you have a Mac. But there is a slight problem. This uses MP3 files and WAV files which means that our M4A file from the iPhone isn't going to work. To fix this issue, we are just going to convert the file using a web converter. So I found some sort of a random converter right here, and I'm just going to drop my file in it and convert it. Okay, so now we will just download the file, and there is the new file that we will use now. And we can head over to Adobe, close this other website, and now simply drag it into the highlighted part, and voila, Adobe is doing its magic. Again, there's a slight wait time for it to do its processing and optimizing your audio, and I'll be back with you when that's done. So I downloaded the file, and here is what the different sounds like. An audio recording of the test footage that I want for the video. An audio recording of the test footage that I want for the video. There's a huge difference, right? And imagine if you were doing this manually, it would probably take you upwards to like 10, 20 minutes if you're good at that stuff. Well, I personally kind of struggle with audio editing and getting the right waveforms and stuff, but this is gonna make my job way easier. And also, if you're a creator, it makes the budget that you need to start actually creating videos way less because the only thing you need now is a phone with a kind of decent microphone and this is going to handle the rest. So hopefully this video was helpful for you. Don't forget to subscribe so we can get to that 1K mark and I will see you in the next one.